So these three attacks all run into each other, right? So anytime you're going to an arm bar, you have these two other fail safes. So I'm gonna pop this off. I'm gonna block the elbow, same way, boom, leg <laughs> comes around and I'm locked. If he is able to get this arm out, I'm gonna bring my leg around his head, swivel to the opposite side, lock and pull. <laughs> if I can get this arm over, I will definitely do that. And when I do that, I'm gonna to try to hide the shoulder and then squeeze. If I go for the triangle and there's a lot of shoulder here, it's gonna be very difficult to block off this artery, okay? So if that does happen, I'm gonna to try to hip out and then take the space. And watch my legs, it's not this. I'm bringing my knees as close together as possible and locking everything down. So when we're going for that arm bar, we're here. I swivel, pop out, leg comes around. Oh no, he got this out. I could go through for the omoplata like the last one, or I'll swivel to the opposite side, locking everything in and pulling one more time. Swivel. I always like to get this here. So great clamp. If your leg is still down here with your arm bars, really try to get it. You can't really go too far here because if you do, we're into our own plugs. Okay. So he pulls that arm out, swiveling to the opposite side. And when I do this, I'm kind of hanging on his back. Hips pop up, and I go to the other side. If all this shoulder is showing, bring the arm across, grab the top of my shin. If I grab here and he postures up, I'm, wrist, uh, I'm ankle locking myself. So I want to grab the back, lock, swivel, swivel, and finish. If he goes to defend by driving forward, I want to create my angle like we were talking before because now he can't lift or stack me. Try to stack me, try to stack me, drive in, drive in, and we sweep. Let's try. One, two, 